Miss Johnson, the defendant is your sister. I think what I read here is that you're twin sisters. Is yes. That right? What I read in your complaint is that when your mom passed away, there was a lawsuit as a result of some sort of negligence. And each of you received, in 2016, a substantial settlement of that lawsuit. I think each of you received somewhere close to $150,000. Is that correct? Yes. Sometime in 2017, in early 2017, your sister, according to you, asked for money. She said she needed money for what? For personal business. What does that mean? That nothing's personal here? Phone bill, expenses to live. So what did I you asked do? Her for some, I asked her for some money. Yes, I did. Do you work? Part-time. What do you do? Production art. What do you do with the other part-time? School. What kind of school? Straight University. For a bachelor's degree for my criminal justice. How long have you been going to school? For like three months. How old are you? 49. How much do you get for going to school? Nothing. Who pays for the school? Financial aid. How much do you get in financial aid? 9000 a year. Do you have to pay any of that money back? Yes, ma'am. When? When I graduate. How many credits do you have so far? I just started school, so I don't have any. And you're going to school part-time? I take two classes for right now, but it's full-time. It's four years of college. If you take two classes... Per, per semester, sir. If you take two classes per semester, and it's a four-year college program, you're going to be 80 by the well, time I'm you sorry. graduate. Well, excuse me, uh, Your Honor. And all that time, you're going to be getting $9,000 a year financial excuse aid? Excuse me, Your Honor. I mean, two, two classes per quarter of the year. What'd you do with all the money that you got from your mother's settlement? Well, first of all, I didn't get what my sisters have gotten because I took what out loans. What did you get? I said, I, I got $100,000 total after the loans I've taken out prior to... I don't to care I about the, the loans you've taken out. You're the grown-up lady. You're almost half a century old. What I'm asking you is how much money you got from your mother's financial settlement. $100,000. In total? I'm in not talking to about... In total. How much did you get? 149000 Why did she get $50,000 less? We all got the same amount of money. Of course you did. Well, I took out a loan prior to I got my money. So that's, that's why when the checks was... Who loaned you the money? Oasis loaned me the money before okay. I got so my settlement. I, uh, I, got I got it. So you got $149,000, but you spent part of it before Bef you even got it. Yes, ma'am. That sounds like what we're doing with school. Yes, ma'am. Perfect. It's, uh, it's okay. Perfect. Yes, so you blew it. Yes, ma'am. What do yes, you do for a living? I'm in human services. I already have my degree in human services. Do you work? Yes, I do. For I, whom? I work for the uh, Bergen County... Uh, Counseling, I, I do human service counseling. Who do you live with? I live with my husband and my son. How many sons do you have? I have one. How old? He, he'll be 25 this month, next month. And he lives at home? Yes, he's in school. He's still in the school. He's about to graduate. Chasman work? Yes. What kind of work does he do? Well, he's retired. Well, he's on disability, actually, excuse me. And he does, uh, uh, he works for the charter school down in the area where we live, and he's a uh, crossing guard. So he does that for to supplement the income that, we, that he gets for disability. And who do you live with? My, a friend of mine. Your sister doesn't have to help you with bills. That's your responsibility. You're 49 years old. How much money did you take from her? $1,500? I don't really remember. How much money did she take from you? Uh, I have a breakdown, but just, um, I you do... Just tell me, in January of 2017, she called you, according to your complaint. I gave her... Uh, I sent 1500 That was the first amount because allegedly I, you know, she called and she was like, um, can I borrow some money? And I was like, well, I advised her to put some of the money into a, a investment account, which she told me she did. And when she called me to ask for money, I was like, listen, you're going to have to go to the bank and say that you're going through a hardship and they'll be able to release the funds, hopefully. And then you mean she you're talking about putting money in, like a, in something like a CD that couldn't be taken out? Well, it's an investment account, like a retirement, you know, because that's what I did. I put some, most, some, some of the money away, you know. So when she called me and I, 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 I was like, well, what are you talking about? Just call them and they'll let you. And then when she went to them, allegedly, she called me back. Oh, they confiscated my money. They have a pat. How much did you give her at that time? It was um, 1500 uh, total. I, uh, Western Union, I, she received... I'd like, to see, I'd like to see proof of it. January, she right here, the, below here, January 13th. So it was 1374 Just a and, uh, What kind of friend do you live with? Male oh. friend or female friend? A, a, a male friend. Does that male friend work? Yes, he do, but it's part-time work, but it's not consistent work. You owe your sister $2,074. Pay her!
judgment for the plaintiff. We're done.